He's too far up. No, you might be able to reach him if he doesn't go further. I need to like scare him. All right. Down. Mountain kids, I'm out here walking in the woods with Gaia, my daughter, and she's trying to catch a blue belly because oh, she wait. has never successfully. She has been part of catching blue bellies, but never caught one all the way on her own. I guess I'm outing her a little bit. Um, but anyway, there's a blue belly that is seeking refuge up in this incense cedar. And I don't know if I've ever seen a blue belly like eight feet up in a tree. But up in this incense cedar, hopefully you can see it. Um, it's right in front of me and I'm not wearing my glasses, so I'm trying to make sure that it's right where I think it is. Yeah, there it is. Not doing a good job keeping track of it. So blue belly, right in front of us. Um, so I've seen a blue belly around my house, which I already shared that video. But the blue bellies, are, of course, are out here in nature, and they're going to be in the sunnier west and south-facing slopes of the places you go to. Whatever is going to be drier and sunnier is where you're going to find our reptile friends. And this. Uh, Northwestern Fence Lizard, which is the fancy name for the blue belly. They're out there, so mountain kids get up, get out, and get into it. And remember, you can catch them if you can, but make sure you don't make them lose their tail because their first tail is their best tail. And that is the end of the tail I'm going to tell. Bye-bye.